Hey, Amy. What do Bob Graham, George Smathers, Oprah Winfrey, and Dr. Henry Heimlich have in common? Henry Heimlich? The one who invented the Heimlich Maneuver? Yeah, that's the one. I can't think of one thing. What is it? Well, they all participated in competitive speech and debate in their younger years, and each of them credit that involvement when talking about their successes. But only two of them were lucky enough to be on the speech and debate team when they were students at the University of Florida. Both U.S. Senator and former Governor Bob Graham and former U.S. Senator George Smathers represented UF in speech and debate in the competitive realm. George Smathers was even the president of the team at one point in time. I'm Kelly Roberts. I'm a faculty member in the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences in the Dial Center for Written and Oral Communication. I'm also the director of the speech and debate team and a UF alum. I have my undergraduate degree in speech communication all the way through my doctorate. And I'm Amy Martinelli. Just like Kelly, I'm an alum of the University of Florida. I received my bachelor's degree in English in 2001 from the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences. And now I've joined Kelly as an alum of the speech and debate team to now serve as the assistant director of speech and debate. For over three decades, I have had the pleasure to work with hundreds of UF's finest students, including Amy, who chose to be part of the speech and debate team, whether continuing their involvement from high school, or maybe they jumped in for the very first time after taking a public speaking class in the Dial Center. They've all gone on to do amazing things with their lives. And for over a hundred years, students have participated in speech and debate at the University of Florida. The College of Liberal Arts and Sciences focuses on expanding students' worldviews giving them a footing to grapple with the world's most challenging questions. With a foundational knowledge of diverse topics and subject areas, the critical thinking and creative skills our students gain are unmatched. It's much more difficult for employers to train someone on those soft skills, but a strong liberal arts education sets students up for success by building communication skills and critical thinking. We can attest that competing in speech and debate allows students to develop a full toolbox of skills including confidence, public speaking and argumentation skills, teamwork, including things like collaboration, negotiation, and maybe most importantly, how to recognize and appreciate differing perspectives and opinions. I was lucky to be part of the speech and debate team as a University of Florida student, and I've dedicated my life to this activity. I'm proud to be able to continue students to take these skills into any field, whether it be medicine, the arts, English, or law. That's exactly what a degree in liberal arts and sciences should do. And what made me and other students spend our weekends and all of our free time on this activity. It's the camaraderie and long lasting friendships that we solidified on the road. In those 18 passenger vans. For as long as we can remember, our team received generous funding, up to as much as $80,000 a year. But as you know, times have changed and those funding mechanisms are no longer available to us. Normally, we used to travel 16 weekends a year. Now, maybe we're lucky enough to travel to two, maybe three. That's not enough to maintain the national recognition in this activity or that the University of Florida deserves. So please, help us to continue this amazing legacy. Your gift of any size really does matter and can help afford students on the speech and debate team the ability to build those skills while also representing the university and the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences as they travel across the state and nation. Our students on the speech and debate team and our communication studies minors in the Dial Center are game changers. They'll transform from learners to leaders. They're passionate and ready to help build an innovative and ethically driven future. Your gift to the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences, to the Dial Center for Written and Oral Communication, or the Debate Society ensures these students can channel their curiosity and cross the finish line prepared for success. We urge you to consider supporting the UF Debate Society with a gift that will not only get us back on the road, but maybe help us find the next Jim Belushi. Wait, Jim Belushi, really? Yes. <laughs> Jim and his brother John both competed in speech and debate on their way to becoming comedians and movie stars. Wow. When you support the Dial Center, Speech and Debate, or the College of Liberal Arts and Sciences that you are most passionate about, 
you're demonstrating your commitment to curiosity and a top five education. And of course, go, go Gators! Gators!